look at you and it's easy to see You are that someone I've been trying to meet I got your number, won't you pick up the phone? Don't leave me hanging on the dial tone Think back to the night that we met Jumping in the pool, talk to you, dripping wet Nervous when I speak, so I trip on my tongue Never thinking you would be my number one you're doing good I hope you're taking care of yourself um, so we came from the doctor's appointment and it went okay the two months appointment usually they get a lot of vaccines they get three they get three vaccines one of them has like four of them in it but of course she cried when she got those two shots um, and then the oral one for the rotavirus but yeah, so far, she's been fine. She's actually slept a lot this afternoon. Uh, she's more sleepy. Anyway, right now she's just kind of sleeping. I put a hat on her because it's kind of getting a little chilly, but not too bad. I just don't want to it to get super chilly when I'm out there and then she's feeling too cold. So I'm just taking my evening walk for the day. Um, and then tomorrow is my birthday hey um i don't even know how what i'm turning i stopped counting after that see i don't count i just celebrate and thank god for another year whatever that number is we leave it to god something smells really nice as someone who uses a really good detergent or fabric softener anyway um do i have anything on my mind today to rant about let me just say I pray to God for the spirit of of um, humility and letting go. And I can tell you, God has really been working on me on that one thing. And I thank God. Anyway, let me enjoy this beautiful, beautiful weather. And I will catch you guys later. <laughs> Bye.
Happy birthday to me. Today's my birthday. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, I was just saying, like, I put a, an Instagram post for my birthday and I was like, you know what? I think after 30, I stopped counting. Like, I, I don't know what I'm turning. I think I know. I just, I always confuses me, but I do celebrate my birthday. I just don't know what year I'm turning. It, I have to really count <laughs> for me to know what year I'm turning. After 30, is just... Anyway, I'm so grateful to God for another year. I feel blessed. I am counting all my blessings. I was reminiscing the other day about where I am right now in my life. Um, there's a place I would want to be, but right now where I am, I am living in an answered prayer. This is an answered prayer. So I am super grateful, taking the time to be really, really grateful to God for <clears throat> where he's reached me now. I'm honestly i'm overwhelmed i am overwhelmed so grateful life is good my family is great my kids are great i may not be exactly where i would want to be but i am right where god needs me and that is all i need in this life of sin <laughs> um so i told you yes i uh, earlier on that this week is packed with doctor's appointments um yesterday we had her her two months um checkup well checkup where she gets her vaccines i was so impressed because they usually say those two months vac those vaccines can really like her she can have a fever she can be very fussy whatever she had nothing actually she's been the best she has been in a long while mama you okay the best she's been in quite a while like she, I, it was just really good so i'm grateful to god she took her vaccines quite well uh so now i'm at i just got to her um, chiropractic appointment uh this week is the last week we're doing two appointments and then next week we'll go to one appointment a week i believe and i go back to work next week i am not thrilled <sighs> i'm not so thrilled but you know it is what it is gotta put on my big girl pants and go back to work it's been a good uh it's been a good time off it's definitely been good but anyway let me take this girl get her adjustment done uh we're gonna go do some birthday brunch with uh with my husband and then we'll see we'll see where the day takes us we'll see where the day takes us anyway guys it's already been almost three minutes Aye. and they don't like rambling okay bye i'll catch you guys later you found the one you should never give her up I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah I surround my soul with the positivity That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah These days I don't worry about much I think we should have some more fun I still dream about the days when we were young I'll take a hit and still finish and one, yeah, yeah Guess who's in town? Ah, me. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. But how many years have I known you? 2010. 2010. That's 2010. That's 14 years. <gasps> I know. That's a long time. I know. It's a long time. Area. Yes. <laughs> uh, let's take a picture. <laughs> I'm sorry if the video is a little dark, but. It's the night of my birthday. It's been a really good day and I'm so grateful. I'm having leftover brunch for dinner. <laughs> and I added a piece of carrot cake. And I think I finally got my Medela pump to work. Let's see if it's actually working. I went to YouTube and YouTube has finally helped me figure it out. But um, yeah, you wanna say hi to my peoples? What's up? birthday things <laughs> yes yeah, so let me just have dinner which is brunch for dinner some hot chocolate and pump and call it a night 
I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Found the one you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take a hit and still finish and one, yeah, yeah. One day when we make it, babe. Hey guys, so today is actually Wednesday. And let me first of all pause this. Um, oof. My man, my man, my man. Anyway, um, I'm getting ready to take this one to her doctor's appointment for today. I told you guys, it's all week except Friday. So let me go ahead and get ready myself and get her ready. Uh, put her in the car so we can start driving because it's a little bit far and then when I come back I'm hoping to make some chicken and broccoli. I'm also hoping to unbox my birthday gift I think I showed you a little bit of what it is, but I just want to unbox with you guys I'm so excited We're gonna be taking this video graphy to the next level, right? Um, what else is happening? Yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, just doctor's appointments, come home and do home stuff. And I'll bring you along with me um, if I'm able to. So right about now, let me go get changed because time is running out. Um, and I'll probably see you guys at the doctor's office. At the doctor's office. Can't speak. Lord Jesus. Okay, mama, we go change. Her hair is always so cute. Oh my goodness, this hair. So adorable. Anyway, I'll see you guys later. We went to the doctor's appointment. Uh, I went well. We will be going back in like three months uh, or sooner, depending. So we just picked up Theo. He's over here behind and Natalie is over there. Uh, today has been a testing day because wow, this girl has cried. Woo -wee! So now we are here at CVS. Um, my husband has gone inside to pick up her prescription because she has reflux. <sighs> oh my goodness. 
And I tell you, every child is different. Theo was not a crier. He was quite an easy baby. Oh, this one, this one has showed me, this one has shown me things. What? Hey. Anyway, some days are good, some days are bad. And like, I have to really watch what I'm taking. And I've like literally stopped taking anything like with like too much spicy food. I, I'm not taking that. So I don't know what it is that kind of triggered the reflux because it had really, really gone down to where I wasn't even using medication anymore. Now, hey, today, today she has shown me. Anyway, um, we're, I'm just going to wait for Willie to come back with the prescription. And then we're going to go home and just start our nighttime duties today i might have to feed both babies by myself because he's prepping for uh someone that he's preaching tonight but anyway we'll see how the day goes i hope you guys are doing well my day today has just been i've been let me tell you my my outfit is all dirty like i've been spit upon so much like this over here is still wet and drying i don't know if you can see that patch I've been spit up on so much today, but you know what? It's called being a mother. It's called being a mother. I'll see you guys later. that that audio for today drained me but i'm still happy it's 10 20 i am finally making the chicken and the broccoli uh, marinating the chicken tenders and i am also making some grilled cheese sandwich for my son's lunch tomorrow so once I do that, I'm just going to eat, pump, and call it a night. Let me finish cooking. Done pumping for the night. Um, got almost six ounces on this one and four and a half ounces on that one. It's about ten ounces. Not too bad for someone who also breastfed. Um, yeah, I mean, during the day. So let me go ahead and pack this up and call it a night i will see you guys tomorrow good night So we are here at the dermatologist's office and I mainly came to see <coughs> Wait. Sorry Anyway, I came to get checked out because of my melasma I don't know if you guys can see it 
my skin got extra dark like you can see on this side it's even worse you can see the demarcation you can see where my skin my skin tone like over here and where the melasma starts so all that was from this one's pregnancy i don't know if there's anything that can be done about it but we will see we will see so after this i have to take her to a chiropractic appointment and i'm done with doctor's appointments for the for the week so let's wait and see what the doctor says so i just got done um something else i wanted to talk to her about was my skin tag you see the skin tag over here so she went ahead and froze this one and then it's supposed to fall off so i have a couple others like on my neck like this one and a couple more that needs to be in these ones so we'll do these ones um with time because she wants to see how my skin will react uh she doesn't want to cause hyperpigmentation for me so we're just going to do one and then um she's given me she's prescribed some some creams for the hyperpigmentation so but the thing with melasma is it might brighten it but it's probably never gonna go back the same melasma is some form of like permanent skin damage it's your skin will probably never go back to being exactly the same the way it was before so this was my former complexion and i'm trying to get this to look like this it's probably never gonna get there but we can try to get as close as possible so by the way i really really love that dermatologist she's amazing i she's a she's young she's uh, i just love her she's very thorough i just feel such good vibes with her like she's really good and my daughter when i had brought her first um her acne her skin was bad it was bad um and of course with whatever prescription she gave us it went away with like two three days it cleared and now her skin is flawless she has flawless skin and it's just amazing so i kind of feel like i trust her so if you want a dermatologist uh plug please let me know i'm more than glad to recommend her they also give me some samples of um what's it called sunscreen because i have not been using sunscreen guy and one of the things is melasma because it's more of sun damage it's kind of chemical damage but also can be uh the sun is like a it's like a accelerator and since i was pregnant during the summer when the sun is hot there's already a lot going on inside me so chemically and then now the sun because i wasn't wearing sunscreen and i think that's how i ended up getting melasma but they ended up giving me samples of la roche posay sunscreen so i'm gonna use this suck for the gimme give me a lot <laughs> give me a, quite a lot so once i'm over and done with this i am just going to replenish and buy some more i actually currently use la roche posay maybe they need to sponsor me i need to be an influencer for this brand because that's what i currently use my cleanser uh and my and you know my what is it called not i can't think of the name what's it called moisturizer they are La Roche Posay, so and now I'm adding their um, sunscreen. I'm not going to try and say this name, Anthelios. Yeah, Anthelios. So that's yeah. So let me. I have about an hour before her next appointment. I'm trying to see how effective, how effectively I can manage this time between. I probably I there's so many things I want to do I think I'm gonna go to Target and get her and try to look for a formula but there I'm, I'm testing I'm say I'm testing and trying kind of doing a combination formula and breastfeeding because I'm not gonna stress myself anymore breastfeeding we've done for three months like we're, we're doing good and I'll still keep doing it but I want to there's a formula that I want to try or try for her that's lactose free and see um just trying and see if she does well with it because you know just testing and trying and then i also need to pick her up some sweaters i don't have sweaters or warm clothes for her because it's we're, we're getting into fall now and it's kind of starting to become a little cold i don't have enough sweaters for her actually i don't have sweaters for her um because she was a summer baby so i only bought warm clothes because we're gonna be in the house so i need some warm sweaters 
so i wanted to go to my thrift store that i usually go to buy baby's clothes i also need to get theo some jackets because he also doesn't have jackets for for the winter so i need to go pick those up so i don't know if i have enough time to go do that and then head to her other appointment with the chiropractor we'll see let me stop yapping and figure myself out but yeah that's about it i will catch you guys wherever i go next so we got done with her chiropractor appointment actually when i left the last time i talked to you i didn't go do anything i just went straight home i fed her because i need to drop off my husband's wallet he was in the car uh, and then we went for the doctor's appointment. So now I am here. Yep, that's where I am. I want to see if I can pick up a few clothes for the babies. And then probably head back home because she was being a little fussy today. Especially at her doctor's appointment. So I don't want to stay too long on this side. So... Let's go inside and find some outfits. I hear the beat. It's in my chest. Got me feeling some kind of way. I confess the rhythm takes over. No room to rest. My heart's dancing. It's a love conquest. breakfast and I started off my day with I'm gonna say it was fine but last night I had ordered some groceries from Walmart but the driver took off with my baby's formula and so I tried to call customer care but it was too late in the night it was past 10 so I handled it this morning thankfully they are going to give me a refund but i'm just thinking <clears throat> why would a driver because obviously it was the driver because b the, from, it shows i was picked up from the store but it never made it here or maybe the person who was doing the shopping didn't i don't i, I really don't know what happened but somebody charged me for a formula but it never arrived if it's the driver whoever god forgive you i'm getting my refund thankfully so right now i just want to do a quick haul for the things that i got the babies yesterday i got more for baby girl than theo because his dad had just gotten him some clothes not too long ago so he's kind of good on the clothes front so let's see um got a little cute jacket baby girl I do I needed some long sleeve onesies for her because you know and this is why I shopped there look at that price this is why I thrift shop perfect condition she's only gonna wear for a few months I ain't spending a whole lot of money I thought this was so cute it's like a little dress for Christmas it's red and this one was this was a little expensive, six fifty. That's quite expensive. <laughs> um, I also got some more sleeping pajamas. This was three fifty. She's about to outgrow her current ones, so I'm just getting ready. This is the jacket I got for Theo. Nice black jacket that can go with anything. I wish I got one that has like. And it looks like it did have a place for the hood 
but i guess that's what you get when you thrift shop you don't get all the parts <laughs> um some more cute little sweaters for baby i know mama i know this was also six fifty. dollars a little expensive. The jacket was $10. Pressed in condition. Another little jacket. I like the zip-up ones because they are easy to remove. I don't even know why I got these ones. Because these ones, they were getting them off the head. Oh, Lord have mercy. But it was cute, so I couldn't leave it. And I got some more long sleeve onesies. Um, this was two fifty. Perfect condition, by the way. Oh, it has buttons on the back. Cute, 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 cute. You guys. <laughs> cute little jacket. This was only six fifty. This. Again, I always check the buttons before I, I pick it up, and it's perfect condition. Thrift shopping. This is for my son. It's like a hoodie and pants combination. Um, those are the only two things I got for him. I didn't get much. And then let me just put this back here. So I don't have to keep bending. Some cute little pants. These are for staying in the house because she's out growing things so much. And this cute little peplum top. I can't wait to do a put her on this one with some you can go very well with this as a whole outfit <laughs> hey dressing girls is so much easier this was 850 this was quite expensive and then we have another long sleeve onesie because of the cold coming in so i wanted more long sleeve onesies Got some more little cute pants for staying in stores. Um, I don't know why I bought this, but I bought it because it was cute. <laughs> this little cute girl outfit. Oh, she came here with stockings. This whole outfit, guys, this was four dollars and fifty cents. I'm not kidding. Four fifty this little cute outfit mama huh your belongings are cute have they come back now okay i'm not mad so i will start going to church huh? <laughs> and then i got two more um sleeping pajamas she's about to get into this size very quickly this is this was six huh this was 650 this is so expensive. I think it's because it's from Nike. <laughs> Six fifty for a pajama. That's too expensive. And then this one. I think this one has a little bit of a micro stain somewhere, but nothing we can't get it off. All right, that's it. And that is the end of the haul. So, I am currently saving the Maju Diaries episode that's supposed to be going out. It was supposed to have gone out yesterday. But yesterday, y'all know, I had two doctor's appointments and there was no way I was going to be able to finish editing uh, or even start editing. It was not going to happen. But today is a little bit of an easier day. We are thinking of going. So, right next to us, they just opened a Kroger um which is opening today so might stop by might depending on how the day goes but i also want to kind of start preparing for work on monday so i'm <laughs> i just got uh charging my work phone i need to check my laptop check to start checking emails um what else do i gotta do today i don't think i need to cook today so just it's okay, Mama. Mommy is done. Mommy is done. Okay, come. And then I need to wash. Oh, today, I think today's gonna be laundry day. Today is definitely laundry day. I got lots of laundry to do. I got these clothes to wash. I got my clothes and Harvey's clothes to wash. So, 
fun. This thing was quite stained. How come I didn't see it? Hmm. Can't return. Okay. It's okay. I am mama. You hungry? You go get you a bottle? We go get you a bottle? You go get you a bottle? Are you already hungry, hungry? Okay, let's go get your bottle. We go with me bottle? All right. I look at you and it's easy to see. You are that someone I've been trying to meet. I got your number, won't you pick up the phone? Don't leave me hanging on the dial tone. Think back to the night that we met. Jumping in the pool, talk to you, dripping wet. Nervous when I speak, so I trip on my tongue. Saturday morning uh, it's a little bit chaotic <laughs> because I have been left home with the babies by myself today and so and I'm pumping so I don't know if you can hear that sound so I'm pumping but I do want to unbox this let's unbox together okay let me get remove this mama please please don't start Please don't start. bunch of manuals and things we'll have to go through. Now keep this in the box. Let's just see what's here in the box. Mm, so this is a little um it's like a, a protective cover. Or you can even put like the wide angle lens and yeah black pearl mist is that Let's 
is the coolest part. I love this scary case. It's so cute. Let me open it. It has compartments. And this is the little beast. This right here. That's the camera. This is a screen, but it's protected. So we tear it together. And then this is the extender, um, the battery extender. The microphone, I put it back there. This is another, this is kind of like the accessories extender where you can um, uh, connect it to the, to the tripod and you can also charge hey mama come on let mama finish what she's doing okay yeah and lastly the little tripod thingy so the Accessory. So this is this is the one that you can you connect this to the camera. Oh my goodness, this is good, horrible. So you connect this to the camera like that. Oh wait, like that. And then now you can add this the tripod in. There you go. And I believe I've unboxed everything. Oh, the little rat thing, or what are they called? This one, you put it on over the mic uh, to muffle the sound. There you go. Like that. And there should be a little mug. This should be some more. Sorry, mama. And a charging uh, USB, USB-C charging thingy. And this is the wide angle lens. This is your wide angle lens. It comes this because this is the um, creator combo. It comes with this. The other, the one that's not a creator combo, does not come with with this. So I'm just gonna put this back here and protect it. Um, yeah, I believe I have unboxed everything. I'm just gonna put everything apart mm -hmm. and I'll charge this up and um, and start using it or start seeing about how to use it. Yay! Wow, today, hey, Whew. Saturday evening. Today will go down in history as. <laughs> one of those days you know one of those days you could just like rub off from history but anyway um truly grateful for the gift of life but hey i just want to eat and sleep because oh lord lord how much said today drained me today drained me anyway let me have my dinner i'm having some time to myself right now i'm alone um just time to take a breather. Let me say that. Take a breather. It's very necessary. When you can get one, take one. But yeah, um, let me have my dinner. I need to finish setting up uh, the camera. I just downloaded the app, the DJ, the DJI Mimo app. Mimo. I was meant to have this thing because Mimo is my name. I was really meant to have it. I just need to finish setting up, clean the dishes, or pump, 
clean the dishes and then go to sleep. And I need to do all that in the next one hour because I just need to sleep today. Whew. Lord have mercy. Let's just hope tomorrow it's going to be a better day. I was supposed to go to church tomorrow, but the way things are going, 99% sure I am not leaving the house tomorrow. So we'll wait and see. <laughs> we'll see if 1% has any chance of moving to a hundred right i guess i i don't think so but anyway i'm rumbling right now so let me call it a night here and i'll see you guys tomorrow if i haven't already said it my baby speeds up a lot and so i thought getting a different trying out this lactose free formula might help let's just say um, I don't know. I still don't know. So it's going to take a while before we figure this thing of speeding up out. But I'll keep trying. We'll see. We'll see. Um, anyway, please let me bring this vlog to an end here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me for the entire week. Um, I do hope that you have enjoyed the vlog. If you have, please do consider subscribing and welcome to the besties. And I will catch you guys on the next vlog. I promise you the quality will be uh, different. Wink, wink. But yeah, thank you so much. I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.